Hello everyone, and welcome to the Iron Fleet channel. From the earliest days of remote-controlled aircraft in the 1940s to today's advanced drones, visionary airmen have constantly pushed the boundaries, reshaping how we engage in aerial combat. In this documentary, we're exploring the MQ-1 Predator, a drone that redefined modern warfare and became one of the most influential unmanned aerial combat platforms ever created. It all began in January 1994, when General Atomic's aeronautical systems received a groundbreaking assignment to develop an unmanned aircraft capable of long-range reconnaissance and precision strikes. This project was initiated under the Advanced Concept Technology Demonstration Program, a bold initiative designed to rapidly transition promising technologies into operational use. After intensive development, the Predator took to the skies for the first time on July 3, 1994, soaring above the El Mirage airfield in California's Mojave Desert. Built upon the foundation of General Atomic's earlier design, the Nat 750, the MQ-1 Predator quickly demonstrated its immense potential with enhanced endurance, sophisticated surveillance capabilities, and, later, the integration of advanced weapon systems. Throughout the initial ACTD phase, from January 1994 to June 1996, the U.S. Air Force took delivery of three complete Predator systems, which included a fleet of 12 drones and three ground control stations. This acquisition was not merely about new aircraft, it marked the birth of a strategic capability that would change military doctrine and the very nature of warfare itself. The Predator's revolutionary ability to remain airborne for extended periods, deliver real-time intelligence, and precisely engage targets thousands of miles away, fundamentally transformed military strategy. In this video, we will delve deeply into the technology, operational history, and groundbreaking impact of the MQ-1 Predator. Understanding exactly why it remains one of the most iconic drones in aviation history. The MQ-1 Predator stands as a formidable armed, multi-mission, medium altitude, long endurance remotely piloted aircraft. Its primary role revolves around intelligence collection while also offering a secondary capability to engage dynamic targets in real time. With extended loiter time, an array of wide-range sensors, a versatile communication suite, and precision weapons, the Predator boasts an unparalleled capacity for strike, coordination, and reconnaissance SCAR, operations against high-value, fleeting, and time-sensitive targets. Moreover, the MQ-1 excels in a diverse range of missions, including intelligence gathering, surveillance, reconnaissance, close air support, combat search and rescue, precision strike, buddy lacing, convoy raid overwatch, route clearance, target development, and terminal air guidance. These remarkable capabilities position the MQ-1 as an indispensable asset for conducting irregular warfare operations, supporting the objectives of combatant commanders. To fully grasp the Predator's capabilities, we must examine its comprehensive remotely piloted aircraft system. A typical Predator operational setup consists of four aircraft equipped with advanced sensors and weapon systems, a ground control station, and the Predator primary satellite link for continuous communication. 
Additional support includes spare equipment and dedicated operations and maintenance teams, ensuring uninterrupted 24-hour mission readiness and reliability. Powering the MQ-1 Predator is a Rotax 914F turbocharged four-cylinder engine, providing 115 horsepower. With a wingspan of 55 feet, a length of 27 feet, and standing 7 feet tall, the drone combines impressive dimensions with a lightweight build. It weighs only 1,130 pounds empty yet can handle a maximum takeoff weight of 2,250 pounds. The Predator carries up to 665 pounds of fuel, allowing for extended mission durations. Its payload capacity of 450 pounds enables integration of critical sensors, cameras, and weapons, enhancing its operational versatility. Capable of reaching a range of 675 nautical miles, the MQ-1 cruises efficiently at 84 miles per hour, with a maximum speed of 135 miles per hour, reinforcing its effectiveness as a persistent surveillance and strike platform. Behind every successful MQ-1 Predator operation, is a specialized team of maintenance personnel whose role is essential to mission readiness. These highly skilled technicians perform thorough pre-flight inspections to confirm the UAV's airworthiness before each launch. Each pre-flight inspection involves a rigorous check, meticulously evaluating every part of the MQ-1 for signs of wear, structural integrity, and the optimal functioning of its critical components. From the drone's airframe robustness to intricate onboard systems, maintenance crews carefully assess all aspects to ensure peak performance and reliability during missions. When decisive action is required, the MQ-1 Predator stands out as a powerful combat asset. Equipped with two AGM-114 Hellfire laser-guided missiles, this drone delivers pinpoint accuracy, effectively neutralizing high-value targets. Its advanced targeting and guidance systems ensure unmatched precision, giving military operators a critical advantage during combat missions. Such impressive capabilities come with a significant investment. Each Predator system, priced at approximately $20 million, includes four drones complete with sensors, a dedicated ground control station, and the essential Predator primary satellite link. This price reflects the sophisticated technology and integrated systems that ensure consistent operational success. Today, around 150 MQ-1 Predators remain in active service, underscoring the drone's critical role and widespread adoption. These numbers highlight the trust placed in the MQ-1's capabilities, solidifying its position as an indispensable element of contemporary aerial warfare. Building upon the success and capabilities of the MQ-1 Predator, the MQ-9 Reaper emerged in the 2000s as a testament to continuous innovation and advancement. Taking its inaugural flight in 2007, the MQ-9 Reaper represents a significant leap forward in unmanned aerial systems. Developed as a more advanced and capable successor to the Predator, the Reaper has become the focal point of airstrikes and various combat missions. The MQ-9 Reaper encompasses a range of enhanced features and technologies that empower it to excel in the demanding realm of modern warfare. With upgraded systems, improved endurance, and expanded mission capabilities, 
The Reaper stands as a testament to the relentless pursuit of excellence in unmanned aviation. In the world of unmanned aerial systems, the MQ-1 Predator and the MQ-9 Reaper stand as remarkable achievements. While both aircraft share some similarities, the Reaper was purposefully designed to be a more advanced and capable UAV specifically tailored for combat missions. Let's explore the distinguishing features that set the Reaper apart and elevate its performance to new heights. When it comes to speed, the Predator reaches a maximum of 84 miles per hour, while the Reaper pushes the boundaries, soaring at impressive speeds of up to 300 miles per hour. The increased velocity of the Reaper allows for swift response times and rapid maneuverability in dynamic combat situations. In terms of altitude, the Predator reaches a maximum ceiling of 25,000 feet, while the Reaper takes to the skies with unmatched altitude capabilities, soaring up to 50,000 feet. This extended operational ceiling enables the Reaper to conduct missions in higher airspace, expanding its reach and strategic significance. Payload capacity is another area where the Reaper shines. While the Predator can carry up to 450 pounds, the Reaper boasts an exceptional payload capability of up to 3,000 pounds. This substantial increase empowers the Reaper to carry a diverse array of mission-specific equipment, enabling it to undertake a wider range of operations with greater flexibility. Furthermore, the power behind these unmanned marvels differs as well. While the Predator relies on a single engine, the Reaper features the redundancy and enhanced performance of two engines. This dual-engine configuration provides added reliability, increased power, and improved operational efficiency, further solidifying the Reaper's capabilities as a combat-ready UAV. The assembly process of the MQ-9 Reaper is a meticulous endeavor that transforms individual components into a fully functional, unmanned aerial system. Skilled technicians carefully integrate airframe sections, wings, avionic systems, engines, sensors, and weapons to ensure the Reaper's reliability and performance. Rigorous quality checks and testing procedures guarantee that the final product meets the highest standards of functionality and safety, creating a formidable platform ready for its critical role in modern warfare operations. The MQ-9 Reaper possesses a lethal arsenal of precision weapons, and the loading process ensures its readiness for devastating firepower. AGM-114 Hellfire Missiles, GBU-12, Paveway-2, GBU-38, Joint Direct Attack Munitions, GBU-49, Enhanced Paveway-2, and GBU-54, Laser Joint Direct Attack Munitions, are among the munitions that can be integrated onto the Reaper. Each weapon is carefully loaded onto the aircraft's hardpoints, adhering to strict safety protocols and ensuring proper alignment and synchronization with targeting systems. This meticulous process equips the MQ-9 Reaper with a versatile and lethal capacity to engage targets with unparalleled precision and destructive impact, solidifying its role as a powerful force on the modern battlefield. The MQ-9 Reaper takes to the skies with precision and purpose during its dynamic takeoff. Powered by dual engines and equipped with advanced technologies, the Reaper accelerates along the runway before gracefully ascending into the vast expanse of the sky. 
This swift and controlled departure marks the beginning of its mission, where it will unleash its capabilities and contribute to the success of critical operations with agility and versatility. During the Joint Force Multinational Combat Exercise of Northern Strike 19, the MQ-9 Reaper made its historic debut, taking to the skies of Alpena, Michigan. Assigned to the 214th Attack Group of the Arizona Air National Guard, the Reaper conducted training sorties in support of this prestigious exercise at the Alpena Combat Readiness Training Center from July 21st to August 2nd, 2019. Northern Strike 19, sponsored by the National Guard Bureau, brought together service members from over 20 states, multiple service branches, and various coalition countries. The Camp Grayling Joint Maneuver Training Center and the Alpena Combat Readiness Training Center, both operated by the Michigan National Guard, served as the locations for this accredited Joint National Training Capability exercise. As the MQ-9 Reaper took part in this dynamic exercise, it demonstrated its capabilities and effectiveness in real-world training scenarios. The deployment of the Reaper highlighted its role as a valuable asset in achieving mission success and further solidified its position as a leading force in modern warfare. In contrast to traditional aircraft, the control of drones takes a unique approach, relying on the assistance of flight simulators. Remotely piloted aircraft, RPA aircrew, composed of skilled pilots trained for this specialized work, engage in simulated missions within the confines of an MQ-9 Reaper cockpit. These flight simulators provide an immersive and realistic environment that replicates the experience of operating a drone in various scenarios. Pilots navigate through simulated missions, honing their skills in controlling the Reaper and executing precise maneuvers. The utilization of flight simulators allows for extensive training and proficiency development, ensuring the utmost precision and effectiveness in RPA operations. The collaborative efforts of these skilled airmen underscore the comprehensive nature of RPA operations. Through the synergy of pilots, intelligence analysts, air traffic controllers, and maintenance professionals, the RPA mission is effectively executed, contributing to the success of critical missions. The adoption of advanced unmanned aerial systems like the MQ-1 Predator has transformed modern warfare, marking a new era in military aviation. From their initial development to their impressive combat capabilities, these drones have proven their strategic value on the battlefield. With its improved speed, higher altitude, greater payload, and enhanced power, the MQ-9 Reaper now carries forward the legacy of the MQ-1 Predator redefining what unmanned platforms can achieve in combat scenarios. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed this deep dive into drone technology. Don't forget to subscribe so you won't miss out on future videos. See you in the next one.